The water supply valve and toilet tank hose are almost always located at the bottom left-hand side of the toilet. There are two main types of water supply valves found on toilets. Ball valves and multi-turn valves. These valves in the plumbing industry are commonly referred to as stops. A valve or stop in a home will normally be connected to either a copper pipe or a threaded iron pipe, depending on the home's configuration. There are dozens of different types of stops and hoses available at hardware stores. For almost every home, the best configuration for toilets is the one quarter turn angle ball stop with a half inch male iron pipe outlet connected to a braided nylon or stainless steel toilet tank hose. This valve and hose provide the best overall reliability, ease of installation, and performance. Since shopping for this configuration can be so confusing, it is helpful to understand how manufacturers label the different types of stops and hoses. Water valves or stops are identified by their style and connections. They are straight stops and angle stops, both having either a multi-turn or quarter-turn ball shutoff. This stop is called a quarter turn angle ball stop with a one half inch nominal compression inlet to attach to a standard copper pipe and a 7 16 to one half inch slip joint combination outlet. The outlet is converted by the removal of the slip joint nut and compression gasket to reveal the desired one half inch male iron pipe outlet, a connection that is ideal for the recommended toilet hose. If a stop for a threaded iron pipe is needed, it would be a one quarter turn angle ball stop with a one half inch female iron pipe or FIP inlet and a 7 16 to one half inch slip joint combination outlet, a connection that is ideal for the recommended toilet hose. The toilet tank hose, which connects the angle stop to the toilet, comes in a variety of inlet connections. Every hose having a standardized 7 8 inch ball cock outlet connecting to either a toilet fill valve or ball cock supply valve. Since this valve has a one half inch male iron pipe outlet, the hose needs to have a one half inch female iron pipe inlet in order for the both to connect. Of all the different kinds of hoses available, the ideal hose are the new nylon or stainless steel braided flex type. These hoses are very durable and can last for years without leaking. When selecting a one half inch FIP toilet hose, six through 20 inch links are usually available. Make sure that there is enough length so the hose is not kinked when it is connected to the valve and the toilet. This is the entire water supply assembly needed to make a copper pipe connection. This assembly includes the angle stop with compression ring and nut and the toilet's tank hose. In order for the copper pipe to make the required connection, the valve's lock nut slides over the pipe. Then the compression ring is slid on the pipe. Next the pipe is fully inserted into the angle stop and the lock nut is securely tightened. During tightening, the compression ring is compressed onto the pipe, creating a watertight seal. Here is a water valve assembly for an iron pipe, which consists of the angle stop and toilet's tank hose. For iron pipes, the threads of the pipe are wrapped in Teflon pipe tape and screwed into the angle stop.